Guys, Bessie bet me 20,000 cookies that I couldn't eat something green. I don't know if I could do this, guys. It's literally been years. All right, all right. Please leave a like if I should do it. All right, it's for 20,000 cookies. It's a lot of cookies. I could eat like 10 cookies a day for the rest of my entire life. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, oh no, 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 can't do it. Can't do it. Not even for 20,000 cookies. Bessie, I'm sorry, I can't do it, okay? I get, I, I'll, like, I'll try again next year, maybe. I'll think about it. Can I still maybe have the cookies? I don't see any cookies in here. There's just a book called New Dragon Species. For the past 30 years, I have been studying a new species of dragons. There are two different types, fire and ice dragons. Travel to the east and find the dragon lair. Defeat it to get new dragon eggs. Love, Bessie. Wait a second, I've known you for a couple years now, and I had no idea you were studying new dragons? That's definitely super cool. I know that we already have basically one species of dragon. We have the ender dragon and all the different types of ender dragons, and uh, apparently there's a new species that I can tame. It looks like in this chest we have a really, really cool looking ice sword. We have dragon meal, a dragon horn, a command staff, a flute, and also a blaster shotgun. Guys, leave a like on today's video if you want me to tame the dragon today and add it to the dragon army. I think I might know what dragon she's talking about. We fought them a couple times in the past. They're really, really huge. They can literally bite your head off. And also, they look really amazing. Andy Chopper, uh, there's apparently a new dragon species that I'm now able to tame and get the dragon egg. But uh, first things first, I have to find the dragon's lair. So let's hop on Andy's back. We have to go east, which I believe is in this direction. And let's go check it out. Dragons, hello, is there any dragons this way? Uh, okay, I don't see any dragon lair. I'm guessing it's underground, because most lairs are probably buried deep underground. Wait a second, I see some fire. Andy, stay here. Rodney, cover my six. We gotta go head in. Yesterday, if you guys missed it, I checked out an SCP factory that I don't know if I wanna head back to. Hopefully, this is a little bit less scary, but okay, it looks like there's a giant hole in the ground. There's fire, so it definitely had to be recent. Let's go head down and check it out. It looks like the fire goes down in this direction. Let's activate night vision and let's see if there's any clues or materials there is a weird new ore here let's grab my pickaxe and check it out so it looks like that was tin ore we have some coal as well i'm looking for dragon eggs though and i'm not seeing anything so far looks like there's a weird block and also wait a second is this diamonds what the heck dude there's just diamonds right there i don't really know any other being that has that amount of firepower to turn coal into diamonds it had to be something massive and i'm not really sure if it kind of came down this way oh wait a second it definitely came down this way look at all of this burnt cobblestone there's also a ton of emeralds redstone and i'm pretty sure only a giant fire breathing dragon could turn coal into all of these valuable materials dragons uh dra i need to steal your your eggs or i need to fight you in the face or something oh no 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 that's a big flipping dragon i definitely do not want to bust in from the top i don't have my jetpack on so we need to figure out a different approach here maybe Maybe I could dig it from the side, but this thing looks like one of the biggest dragons I have ever seen. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. There's a ton of zombies down there too, dude. There's also skeletons with shotguns and there's, oh jeez, dude, the dragon. At least it's sleeping. I wonder if we could slowly sneak in there, grab the dragon eggs. I'm guessing it's laying on top of them and then we can easily just sneak in, sneak out and never have to fight a dragon. Oh no, 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 guys, stop, 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 flipping dragon right there. The flipping dragon is gonna wake up, please, for the love of Jabez, dude. Do not wake up that dragon. He's gonna wreck us all in the face. Oh my goodness, dude. He's definitely waking up. He's moving around a lot. The Enderman's right there. This dude's just literally aiming me down. Why? Do you guys not understand this thing is gonna kill us all? There has to be a better way to do this, dude. Maybe I can go underneath the dragon, dig under him, and then just kind of like stab him a couple times in the stomach. I feel kind of bad. I'm not gonna lie. But I know for a fact this thing is going to try and eat me. No! Stop! Stop! 
stop it now. Oh, poor bro. Okay, Rodney, I need ideas now. You're a smart robot. Do some calculations. What the flip do I do? I have to get out of the sight of those stinking mobs or else it is game over. I'm really surprised the dragon hasn't woken up yet. We have to be close. Oh, okay. Let's see. Is there any mobs? Oh, hey, how's it going, bro? Yeah, you have a shotgun. That's really cool. I got this really giant sword. Let's wreck you. We have to be super stealthy here. Don't shoot the gun. Whatever you do, do not shoot it. It's way too loud. Come here, you muffin brain dudes. Get the heck over here. There we go. All right. I'm able to take him out. The dragon's eyes are still closed. Bro, why are there so many mobs down here? Nope, 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 nope. Don't shoot a gun. Whoever has a gun. Bro, I just told you not to shoot it. What are you doing? All right, we got a boss down. It's time. It is time. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Go back, Rodney. Run. I think he's still sleeping, actually. Wait, who's throwing potions? Are you throwing potions, dude? Or is that Rodney? I really can't tell. Okay, uh, yeah, uh, is he awake? Is he sleeping? It looks like he's kind of twitching out. Stop it. Seriously, do you not see the dragon's about to wake the flip up? Stay back out of my face. Guys, I think I may just have to rush in there. I'm a little bit low, but let's see. All right, I have a dragon head on. Maybe he'll think I'm just another dragon. Oh, no, he definitely does not think I'm another dragon. He doesn't see me, though. He, he doesn't see... Oh, flip, dude, he's biting me. No, 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 no. Please. Oh, bro, I just got turned into KFC. Andy, I might need backup in just a second here. Rodney is absolute poop when it comes to fighting dragons. I don't see the dragon. Are you kidding me? It's busting out. No, no. Do you guys see what you did? You woke up the sacred dragon. I could have went in there. I could have been super stealthy, but no. You guys just literally had to try and wreck me in the face. You giant muffin brain idiots. Bro, he actually just busted out. Okay, all right. I don't see any eggs. Maybe, he, oh my gosh, he probably knew I was coming for them, and then he literally just stole them and took them away. Oh, no, no, no. He's fighting Andy, and he's getting wrecked. I gotta, I gotta start shooting. Bro, I just got incinerated again. Run, run, run. Andy's able to respawn, but dude, he is getting destroyed. No, 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 Andy. Stop it, Andy. Bro, no, no. Run, Andy, while you still can. I'm getting destroyed. Please, please, please don't do this to me, bro. Andy only has 30 health left. Come on, man. I only have like two health. Andy is way too tiny for this. He only has 30 health. Andy has to finish it. Please, 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 please don't die on me. Bro, I only have like two hearts. I gotta shoot. That was my chance. Dude, he has 30 health. Come on. He is literally flaming everything. Andy only has 15. I can't do anything. I'm too far. Come on. I just gotta spam it. He, yes, we just, oh, oh my gosh. I don't even have words. That was the scariest thing ever. Oh my gosh, Andy, nice work, dude. Luckily, I brought him along, or else the fire dragon probably would have just left. Now, I'm gonna need to find the dead body somewhere over here. Uh, or is there any dragon eggs that fell out? Everybody be on your toes. We need to find a dragon egg. A-S-A-P. I don't see one over here. Andy, anything? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Right here, we have a fire dragon egg. It's a lot tinier than the ender dragon egg. Uh, is there a way for me to pick it up, or can I punch it? Yes, oh my gosh, we actually got a fire dragon. Well, you know, I'd like to take all the credit there, but I really didn't do anything. Andy kind of just took over and destroyed that dragon in the face. Only problem is, I'm not really sure how to get back to Bessie. I'm gonna hope it's this way. No, no, turn, 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 turn. There's another dragon. I repeat, there's another dragon, and he knows I stole the egg, bro. No, no, please. Just go, go, go. I literally have four hearts left. So it looks like this is where the dragon actually busted out of his giant nest underground. I honestly didn't even know that was possible. Okay, we managed to make it back to Bessie, and I think now we are actually able to set up a nest. But guys, please leave a like if you want me to go find the other type of dragon. Because I believe right now we have a fire dragon egg, and there's also ice dragons that I can tame. So I'm pretty sure I have to use some netherrack and also some dragon nest blocks. Kind of surround the dragon egg with some fire, and then let it kind of sit for a couple days in order to get the dragon egg to hatch. I think this should be good, so I'm going to put one netherrack in the middle, surround it with dragon nest blocks, and I'm going to surround it with a ton of fire on the outside, and hopefully it's enough heat to actually break open the dragon egg. I'm going to put the dragon egg right in the center there, I'm going to light it on fire, yes, okay, it's wiggling around, and I'm going to light the corners of this as well, and then hopefully this should be good, it shouldn't turn into any other dragon eggs, it shouldn't be an ender dragon egg, it should be the species that we just took down. I'm not 100% sure on how long this takes, it could take a minute, it could take hours, 
hours. It could take a couple days. But ladies and gentlemen, if you do want to see a part two where I train this fire dragon and use like the dragon horn, the dragon flute, just leave a like on today's video. Let's go for like 5,000 likes. You guys have absolutely been killing it recently. And I think this could be a super cool addition to the dragon army. But ladies and gentlemen, that is going to have to wrap it up though. My name is Beck Bro Dragon Master. And I will see you guys all back again here tomorrow. Peace out, dudes.